the, the truth about all these Rocky and Creed movies, especially the Rocky movies, is that the fact that there are so many of them can kind of obscure this fact, but when you look at the time between each film, you can usually see this. Uh, they're always a very careful mix of scenes and motivations and things. They may seem like they all have the same formula, and in a sense, they do. But because of that, they have to very carefully craft each one so it's different and unique. And, you know, the fact that they usually t took three or four or five or ten years between them is an indicator of how much time they took refining the story and thinking about it. Because if they made them one after the other, they probably wouldn't have the kind of efficacy that they do. But because they took their time, they were able to mix it up and figure out how to make it just right. And that is hard to do even when you do have time. So I'm not upset that Creed 3 doesn't have that absolutely perfect mix of elements this time around. I think we are very blessed to even be able to say, yes, there is a series of popular films in America and distributed to the wider world. There are nine of them now. And seven out of nine of them are considered very good and very beloved and very powerful.